What's up, Frosher Bros? Welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. It is currently part 5, and last we left off, we were here in the Druid's Grove, and as you can see, well, we're still here. Yeah, uh, had to, we had to get some healing done by Nettie, but, uh, apparently she can't do nothing without, uh, the good old help of Halson. Yeah, so, we have to go grab Halson, and... Anyways, we still have some more to do here in the grove before we head out, so I think we're going to, say, start by investigating Old Tuffet here. And since Will is our animal expert, with the ability to speak to animals, right here like this... Mm -hmm. I'm sleeping. Uh... Hmm, let's see here. Well, what I could do is I could move you a little bit. Uh, I need to use the elevator. Uh, hmm. I don't want to move him. I will, uh, I could use a fish though. That will help. Huh? What's that? Yeah. There we go. No one stopped me yet. And you know, like, I saw him throw something, did it? He actually throw fish? No, the that was weird. Well, anyways, let's just go up the elevator then. Gotta use it, you know. Check it out. All right, let's heading on up. Hey, Will, you go ahead. I see a squirrel up there. All right, heading out. Hopefully, this squirrel is friendly. Hello there, Little Timber. Oh. The squirrel lunges at your foot and bites it. What? Wow! Calm down. I'm a friend. What? What was that for? You barged in without an invitation. I wouldn't call that friendly. See, you're in my territory, and I want you gone. Okay. Well, oh, one word. And I can fry you to a crisp. You do realize that, right? Like, you do know who you're talking to, right? Oh, yeah. This is gonna work. <laughs> okay, okay, calm down. We can make a deal. How about this? You can stay if you keep those ugly feet on the ground. I'll even sweeten the pot. Found some weird smelling stuff on the ground. You can keep it, but these trees are mine. Follow the rules and I won't have to intervene. Got it? All right. Looks like we got a little reward. A Hina here. Shouldn't have wished what did squirrel say? Uh, something about messing with the trees. Oh, I'll mess with the trees. A starion don't do that. The squirrel will bite you. Oh, well. That's the case. Alright, well, uh, <laughs> looks like can't mess with the trees, but that's fine. We, uh, we don't need to mess with the trees to check out what all's going on here. And, hey, look! We found... Oh. Dead guy, uh... Hey, Rika. Not now. Please. Uh... I was joking about Octa's soup just a moment ago. Come on, Rika. Now what? Well, anyways, that seems like a sad moment. Guess those goblins really did fire a mean shot up there. Well, anyways, oh! What's this? There's a bugbear. I'm on it. Alright, so... Gale is on it, so we're gonna have to... Hmm... I have to run up here. Smart. Got a bugbear assassin. Uh, probably put him to sleep. Oh, too many hit points. Yeah, so we're going to... We're going to start by greasing him up. We're going to have to stop him in his tracks. There we go. 
Starion. Oh, darling, this is perfect. You have any idea how much this calls for a firebolt? Ooh. Can't even catch my breath. Well, it looks like this here's quite a toasty situation. I suppose I can cool things off. Oh, this is just terrible. We're just messing with this poor bugbear. Uh, let's see here. If I use Hunter's Park. There we go. He's prone and everything. Yeah, get out of here. Alright, my turn. Let me show you what a what the Blade of Frontiers could do. Eldridge Blast! I, uh... I meant to miss. So I could... Hmm. Well. You little puck! Okay, we need to figure out some other way to mess with them. Perhaps if we... Actually, freezing ray. So that way... Hmm. Well, what I could do is if I were to sneak here, he would find me, so I'll just firebolt, I suppose. I wonder if this is All right, the well, cost. there's only one one thing left to do. Time to last May the gods take you first. Wink and pommel. Whack. Well, that worked. Got some stuff. <laughs> there was a telescope over here. You peer through the telescope. Uh, I mean, what what could that be? Let's see. Here. I'm actually going to focus this telescope. Try to. Cypher it a little clearer that way. Are you kidding me? <laughs> oh, that's that's beautiful. Okay, uh, move the telescope to the left. The telescope points to the left. Point it to the right. The telescope points straight ahead. When try to discern what this is. Hey, we we succeeded. All right. You see a dragon oh. circling like a bird of prey, hunting. Huh. Let's move this to the right. I guess. The telescope would... points to the right. Uh, ain't nothing to the right. Well, that's an interesting occurrence. Hey, uh, Nadira. How you doing? You have good timing. Never been much of a fighter, so wrestling a bugbear would have gone... poorly. But you're not here for heroics, are you? Avernus's stench is all over your skin. Let me guess. Your devil mistress sent you to get her soul coin back. Too bad. I earned it. Fair and square. Uh, lady, listen. The path I follow is much more noble. If you possess a devil's artifact, you should leave it to my charge. I'm going to be chased all over Faerun for this damn coin, aren't I? Fine. Take it as a grudging payment for the rescue. Now leave me in peace. And I mean, real quick, what exactly is this coin? It's a soul wrapped up in a terrible iron package. Don't ask who's because I don't know. I hope it brings you better luck than it has me. Well, I got a, a soul and a piece of metal. That's fantastic. Huh. Well, anyways, I guess we ought to head this way, see what's up. 
All right, so we're going to head on this way because there is one other thing we can do. Of course, the uh, old timbers there still kind of all messed up in this stuff in the brain. But anyways, as long as we don't mess with trees, we'll be fine with timber. And of course, there's Volo still trying to still trying to decipher what the bear is saying, despite not having speak with animals. So that's that's some. Right, right up here. Hey, look at this. We got ourselves a a fear playing a little loot. Ain't that something? away words of mine will change no become uh, ignore me change no damn it uh, are you all right there no i'm moments away from a grisly death at the hands of this bloody song i can't Nothing fits, you know? Uh, let me see if I can help. Mm, it can't hurt. I have her. I have an extra loot, if you want. Alright, first things first. What's the song about? My teacher, Lihala. She loved dancing. Had two left feet, mind. I remember waking up one night on the road and seeing her. Dancing beneath the stars, a huge smile on her face. Thinking of it now, my heart hurts. And my words just seem to crumble like ash. Wait. Words of mine will turn to ash. That's perfect. <laughs> words of mine will turn to ash. When you call the last light down. Yes, yes. Turn. 
sorry. Oh, don't worry. Uh, cry as much as you need. She'd have said the same thing. That's the first time I've played since Lihala died. My teacher. She was playing her lute. We didn't hear the gnolls coming. There was so much blood. Uh, I can still smell it. That sounds terrible. Sorry. It was awful. I couldn't look at a lute without hearing her screaming. I'd forgotten what it was like. That itch to perfect a song. The Weeping Dawn will be my gift to Lihala. I've a long way to go. But thank you. I, I needed this. Well, that's all Fierce Quest started, at least. A little bit of performance there. Now, there's actually a little something down this way. Looks like. A little road leading into a save, so... We're gonna have to get Someone ready for something. Singing. It's beautiful. Uh, beautiful singing. But of course... We were just speaking with Alfira. She's done singing. Mm, something ain't right. Here. I'm gonna drop a quick little save. What we're gonna do is we're gonna split up the entire group. The rest for the wicked, I Gail, you're gonna take the high ground. You're gonna snipe and make sure whatever is down here, you're just gonna keep an eye out, really. A starion. You're gonna take a bush. You're going to be right here, and you're going to sneak. There you go. Soft as ever. Will, you're going to take another high ground. At this point, you're going to be right Let's here. Go. Such a pretty song. All right. Now that everyone's in position. I'll go talk to this boy. Kiddo. You know. Shh. Listen. Hmm. The sweet melody beckons you. It vibrates with magic. A harpy's charm. Oh no, that's that's a harpy's charm. Can't must. Resist! Oh shoot! Natural 20! The suffocating yearning suddenly fades as the spell breaks. You are free. Go, get back, get back! No, no, it's just a bit of water. I only want to listen. Just a little closer. Yes, everything's gonna be fine once I get there. Oh, Lord. Alright. Time to take care of these guys. What the heck? Is Will straight up charmed now? What happened here? What now? Damned monster. I'll All right. make you pay. Oh lord. Will has been charmed. What, right. what happened? Oh no. We're starting to run low. Wait a minute. I'm in control. Alright, what we need to do. Starring, where you at? On it. Alright, so. We're going to need to be very careful with this setup. Gale. Have my attention. On it. So let's see here. I want to drop down. Oh crap. I've entered combat. Well, if that's the case. Starion. 
All right. Let's shoot at this guy. Miss. Love it. Let's have a little fun. Time All to right. move. Back to the bushes with you. No choice but to keep going. All right. Well, that's the case. We're going to need. I cannot lay on hands. So I'm going to have to cure wounds on myself so I can stay alive. And I'm going to vow, so I'm going to vow on you. There we go. Oh, Lord. These harpies are going to be, uh, oop. Lord is knocked off. This is the song. Alright, now we're going to Misty Step. Right over here. There we go. Gail, watch out. Ah. Alright. Let's see here. Arms of Hanar, Armor of Agathus, Pact of the Blade. Alright, let's see here. I can Misty Step. Misty step, say. Hmm. I want to misty step here because I need to get up here and piercing strike you. There's blood in the air. All right. Then you're going to sneak out. Sneak right back. Ah, oh, crap. I'm being lured. Oh, no. All right. Time for old Gale to do his work. Hmm. Sleep on you. And ooh. Sleep. Too many hit points. Why does sleep have so many? Okay, so. Oh. Can I just. One. I can just target one. There we go. Put sleep on you. Quick and lured, kid. Alright. Will. There's a way. Turns out there isn't a way, just a will. Alright. So. We'll do it my way. Sneak over there. Alright. So get down here. You're going to have to bring Solvus up in the next round because 
Going neat, Silvis. Get out of here, kid. Harpies are nasty. Oh no, Gale! Oh crap. This is not good. Hmm. Well. This is probably, uh. This is probably where things are gonna end pretty poorly. Let's find some prey. And of course. Okay. Sounds like fun. <laughs> All right. With the nest. We're gonna have to. Oh, of course, <laughs> grease. Yeah, we're gonna have to reload because. Oh man. The pride of the gate. Will. Will and Gale. I'm gonna place someone together. I guess. Let's go put Will here. Will would be a good spot there. Starion did pretty good when he was hiding here. Your desire. Gale, I'm going to put up here so he can have the height advantage. And Silvis is just going to have to get out here by himself. All right. All right. Sweet melody beckons you. It Fight this with magic. A harpy's charm. The suffocating yet. No. Yeah. All right. We're in. All right. Let's get this over with. An oh dear. This is not good, Mrs. Snare. All right. You're gonna fly down, you're gonna... Oh. We got Will and Gale into combat. Let's rebuke. There we go. Get out of here, kid. <gasps> no! The kid died. No. The kid wasn't supposed to die. Bastards. Put your armor of Agathis up, Will. You bastards of bastards. To do. Flourish that harpy. Battle of wits. Gale Firebolt. And to finish, we're gonna introduce an Astorian into the crowd. And oh dear. There is nothing you can do. Alright, is there anyone you can shoot from this distance? Uh, boss, there's a lot of vision here. It would appear as though I don't have very much to work with. Perhaps if I were to make my way up here and just angle myself right. Perhaps right here in the bushes. Yes, yes, this will do. Ooh. Wouldn't. That would not work, I'm afraid. It is out of my distance. Hmm. Out of my normal distance. I'm afraid I'm going to have to wait here then. No holding back. Alright, well, that being the case. I don't fancy their chances. There's not really much either of y'all can do, so what? You know, do what your singing. Oh, sharp rock thrown at Gale. Oh, Silvis. Yeah, get hit with armor of Agathis. Ain't that something. Now time for a weak track. And that missed. Gale on it. Sucks. Stay out of my head. All 
All right. Now I got the harpies running into areas, different places. And now, it would be perfect for a starion to just sneak right on in. And now, right at the perfect distance where if we really wanted to. Are you kidding me? Lord! On the victor's path. Alright, well, that's the case. Alright, um. What all can we hit? We can hit no blast from here. All right, and let's see here. We can jump up here. Ooh. Still jump up here anyways. And we're just going to go ahead and slap you. Oh yeah. That was pretty perfect. All right, Gale. We're going to grease this one up. There we go, and a starion. The subtle approach. Sneak attack. There we go. Uh oh, starion, look out. Ah, oh, you're being lured. Crap. Will's on the move. Don't trust it, Will. Ah, oh, crap. Anyways. Let's go ahead and reapply Hunter's Mark to and away I you. Go. Swift as my feet can carry me. Run on up. Alright, Gale. Time for you to do your magic, actually. You may want to try your stuff on this first. There you go. Burn that harpy. Now, as for you, Astarian, I remember correctly, I should be able to, without the need of actually, oh my lord, am I actually going to be able to pull this off? No. I cannot wall threatened. I can though disengage, back up, and then just hide, times. and then just rush off. Oh my lord. Ah oh, crap. Damn. Wheels down. I'll make you pay. Go ahead and jump. And let's... I can't. Can I cleave? No, I can't. Rough tempest I will raise. Alright, well... Will, time for you to... Gale, time for you to... On my honor. Fireball. Fireball! Another target taken down successfully. Into the shadows. And... Starion, time for you to just sneak up. Get your backstab in. There you go. Alright. And time for one last good slap. Let's help Will up. And, well... Failed the quest. Didn't exactly do what uh, was according to plan. Kid kind of died. Um, group everyone back up. Lord, everyone get back here. All right, get a good short rest. For Will, we're just going to short rest again. There we go. Alright. 
that's everyone healed up. Still need all of our stuff back, so we may need to just go back to camp soon. But of course, we are running quite long, so I do think this could be a good place to end things for now. Because in the next episode, we're going to have to go mess with some goblins and do all that. And yeah, I think that's basically everything in the grove we can do for now. So yeah, in the next episode, we're going to go mess with some goblins, try to go find and rescue old Housen. But anyways, that's all going to be stuff in the next episode. That's all for this episode. So this has been your bro Frostbrew, and I think I'll catch you all in the next one. <gasps> Later!